My name is Andy Foley. I'm Deputy Chief for Roanoke Fire City Fire and Mists. I've been with the city for 21 years. So we have the first arriving dashboards in all 11 of our stations. We also have an administration as well as a training center. This gives situational awareness to everybody in the field as well as training administration of what calls are going on within the city. Before the dashboards, um, any communication we had would be by paper. So we'd either do email or we would print those papers off and then send them to the mess near bags and then that's how we would communicate to staff in the field. So internal communication has improved with the dashboards. If we have anything that we need to get out to personnel immediately, uh, that'd be training or events in the area or street closures, then we immediately get that up on the board and then that real-time data, and it's not through email or word of mouth. The product features that we were intrigued by was the mapping that shows where the call is, and it gets a map up immediately for our personnel, for messaging for our personnel, as well as integration with the products we currently use to show staffing that is available. The unexpected benefits that we found with first arriving was the customization with the Google Sheet. That way we can produce our own product, so to speak, and get that out to our employees. Uh, what crews appreciate the most is they can see our current staffing level so they know who's on what apparatus. That's very important on any kind of fire scene, as well as, again, the, the address coming up with the mapping, the call type, and a brief description of what the call is. My advice for any organization that wants to implement the first arriving dashboards to increase communications, get their personnel out the door faster, is to go ahead and get them in place and get them up and running.